all the negative peer pressure that abounds in the public school system. I haven't been pressured to drink, smoke, do drugs, or play the boyfriend-girlfriend game. Now a lot of people might ask, but do you have any friends? <laughs> Obviously the answer to that is yes, so I don't have this many people here. <laughs> Unfortunately, some of my best friends were not able to come today, but I think we'll have a good time anyway. I am planning on staying here on the farm and working towards having my own farm someday. I'm also planning on expanding my partnership in our family's grain cleaning business, and we'll probably have my own grain cleaning rig sometime soon. I'll also be continuing my education at the School of Hard Knocks, <laughs> as well as doing some private study in alternative energy and Tesla technology. Did you know that in the 1700s, Johann Bessler invented a gravity motor, a device that can turn gravity into useful rotational energy? Did you know that in the early 1900s, Nikola Tesla was harnessing cosmic rays and sufficient power to power a car? Did you know that in the 1960s, Edwin Gray built an 80 horsepower motor that powered itself? I could go on here, but in the interest of time, I think it will suffice to say that I've learned some pretty interesting things. I could plan to continue studying in this field. I would like to thank my dad. He gave me a very flattering speech before. Oh. <laughs> I'd like to thank my dad for being such a wonderful example to me in many ways. You have taught me the importance of working hard, encouraged me to be an entrepreneur, and taught me a lot about life. I've always tried to be like you, and I think I've come close in many ways. I would like to thank my mom for all the countless hours you have spent teaching me to write, even though I didn't want to, read, over, even though I wouldn't sit still, and do my math, even though I sometimes had to help you with the algebra. <laughs> You have given me a love for music. Thank you. And <laughs> you've given me a love for music and taught me the importance of being kind and considerate to other people. I'd like to thank my sister for going on ahead. Because if she could do it, so could I. <laughs> I have always you have always been a dear friend to me and I have many memories of us doing our school work together. Oh, and thanks for making the cake, too. <laughs> I would like to thank my brother for being a brother. Uh, because life might just be boring without you. You have always been trying to do everything I have done for as long as I can remember. <laughs> So keep on with your schoolwork. You can do it too. <laughs> I also thank God, for he has helped me to become the person I am. He has given me the strength to carry on and kept me going through all those years of schoolwork. I pray that he will lead me as I enter a new phase in my life. I would like to close with a poem that I have come to enjoy by the name of A Farmer's Prayer, which was written by Clell Gannon. I think that's how you say his name. <laughs> the Dagley family sent this poem to me several years ago. I've had it posted above my dresser in my room ever since. I've really come to enjoy it. Dear Lord, I pray, make me as free as is the summer breeze that wanders through the prairie grass and hunts the scattered trees. Make me as common as the dirt that suns beneath my feet and democratic as the air and banish all conceit, and vanity, and snobbishness, yea, march them in retreat. Make me as honest as the birds that sing the prairie lays, as reverent unto my God, as quick to sing his praise, as clean as are the wind-washed buttes, as happy as the sun, as prompt to do my given task, that he may say, well done. Make me as stubborn as a bronco, or the thing that's right, as fixed in truth as are the stars that stab the western light. Give me the cacti thorns to ward away the tempter's heart, and give some fellow man my chance to have a small heart. Lord, teach me 
many humble lessons from the Magi of the Plains, and make my soul as beautiful as are the sunset stains. Let all men know me as a friend, and stop a while to chat. For all the kingly titles, they are not as good as that. Lord, let me know I'm just a part of this big world of thine. I'm not the entire story, I'm just a little line. But make me every inch a man along the trail, and when the sun drops down behind the buttes that rings the world, why then, I won't need to apologize to God or man. Amen. Amen. Thank you all for coming. Your presence has made my day even more special. Thank you. <laughs>